Hi guys, it's Nigeria again. Right, this is just a quick, uh, was it final reveal of my ME109 from Airfix, okay, in 148. And yeah, it went together reasonably quite well, uh, but there was a few uh, little bits of problems, okay. So there she is. I'm gonna do you a, a quick closer up there, there'll be some photos at the at the end okay so what to look for out for on this kit I'll tell you what i'll swing around and then we can have a look all right just two minutes so guys here she is in all uh, detail okay i'll just run you down there so she's mainly painted with uh, uh mr uh hobby colour okay i cut the uh, aquarius or gold cinco whatever you want to call it okay again lovely lovely paint okay i did all the the camo down this side and down the other side with just white tack okay and then tape on top with some pre-shading and some post shading just to lighten some of the panels that you can just see around this area uh, and the rest of them all right uh, the decals uh, went down flawlessly. Uh, to be quite honest, most of this build was really, really nice. Okay, major parts had problems, but around the gun ports, the separate parts. Okay, so I had to use a little bit of filler there, and I just used my uh, styrene filler, filler. You know, the one we, we use with uh, Tamiya Extra Thin or what have you. Okay, the uh, the aerial wire is just some. Uh, knitting elastic okay uh, picked that up for about £2.50 okay as opposed to uh, what, what is it the, the other stuff I can't remember what the name is but the other stuff is about £10 for uh, a lot of, a spool of it so easy line easy line or something like that yeah it's about £10 so to quite honest £2.50 just a quick paint on it and it does a trick you know I think it looks, looks the part quite honest might be a little bit thick but hey ho i've added some seat belts well let me just turn around as you can just see in there hopefully i've added some seat belts and i've just got some sticky back type foil uh, thick foil that i use on my joints uh my copper joints when i'm at uh in, in my training school so i just use that the uh the wash was a MIG uh, dark wash, then with some uh, oil marks, some watercolour marks with and what have you, and the the exhaust, same same as I always use, it was just the uh, pastel, just ground down pastel. And that guys is where she is at, okay? Oh, there she, there she all is, all done and dusted. Uh, quite a reasonably enjoyable build. Uh, went together rather right, well. I lost my mojo a little bit, uh, but then again, I was losing mojo left, right, and centre on on everything I did. So that uh, alone knocked me for six. But eventually got it done. Uh, I like her. I've enjoyed her. Uh, what I might do next time I do one of these kits, one from Airfix or Tamiya or whatever. Is I'm thinking about having a go at re riveting, which might be the I might start the 109, 109, 190. Sorry, next okay. So, that guys is where I'm at. All right, thanks for watching. See you later.